in this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own printable checklist here in Google Sheets. So the checklist that I'm talking about would look like this. So this is something that you can print and fill out with your pen once it's printed and you can always have it reprinted whenever you want to make a checklist for grocery shopping or for an event that you're trying to prepare for or for any occasion in this matter. I'm going to show you how to do it step by step. So just follow along. So we're going to start with a blank spreadsheet. And the first thing we're going to do is to make our header. I'm going to do that by just merging some of these cells right here four at the top and go to merge cells right here. If I click on that, I've successfully merged those four cells. And now I'm going to type in my header. So I'm just going to put in checklist, put it in all caps, type it there. And there it is. Now I'm just going to format it into bold, maybe select another font right here and make this text bigger. If you're satisfied with that size, we can now just go ahead and fill the color of our cells right here. Go to fill color and select black. Now we can't see our text, but that's okay. We know it's there. We can just select it again and change the color of that text into white. Now our header stands out. Time to make the rest of our checklist. So the next thing that we're going to be adding is our checkbox. We can add that to our first column right here. So I'm just going to adjust the size of this column, not make it too big and select the range where I want to add my checkbox. So I'm just going to add up into 20 items. So that's starting from two to 21. That's 20. And now go to insert and select checkbox. Now you've inserted your checkbox. Let's make it a bit darker to match the rest of our checklist. Go to text color and select black. And there you have it. You can also make these bigger by just going to font size increase the size. If you're satisfied, then you can just stop. And there it is. Now we are going to merge the rest of our cells right here because that's where we're going to be writing down all the tasks or things that we want in our checklist. So also merge those cells right here. And we don't need to do that one by one. What we can do is just drag this down or double click on it and it will do the rest with our data. And the last thing that we're going to do would be to put in borders on our checklist to make it stand out some more. So select the range. Now go to borders right here where we can select the type of borders that we want to put in our checklist. But before that, I want something a bit thicker than the normal one. I'm satisfied with the color. It's all black. Now we go to border style. So this is a bit thin. And I want it to stand out some more. So I'm going to select the second one. Once I've selected the border style and the border color, I'm just going to go ahead and select all borders. If I click on that, there we have it. Now we've finished our checklist. So this checklist, we can do more than just one in our spreadsheet. What we can do is to just copy it, select, right click, copy, then paste it right here. Now we are just going to adjust this column right here, our checkbox column to make sure that it matches our first one. And there you have it. So I have two checklists right here, ready to be printed. And once I'm done, all I have to do to print it is go to file on the menu bar and select print at the bottom. If you click on it, you have your print preview where you can see how it would look like once it's printed. Now, as you see, there are some grid lines in the middle that we don't really want to see or be printed when we print this checklist. So we are just going to go to formatting and uncheck show grid lines. If there are some notes, you can uncheck that too. Totally up to you. And now those grid lines have disappeared. And when you're ready to print, all you have to do now is to go to next, select your printer and print your checklist. And there you have it. That's how to create a printable checklist that you can always reprint when you have other tasks or things to check 
on your list. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, do leave a like and subscribe for more helpful videos. See you on the next one.